Well, hello there, humans, hippies, earthlings, whoever you are, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, if you're lucky enough indeed to be doing it too, welcome aboard the Love Train, and this is the IS. Um, standing for, is that tank still around? I don't, I can't remember the last time I featured an IS on channel, and it's funny because this used to be the tier 7 monster tank, run around at tier 7 in an IS uh, it was a great way to farm damage. It was one of the best tier 7 heavies you could get. And indeed, it was one of the best tanks at tier 7 you could run. And that's a long time ago now. The idea that the IS would be considered one of the best tanks in its tier now, after we've had Draculas and Helsings and all kinds of other crazy stuff like the Smasher pop along, uh, is just fantastic. Um, <clears throat> so I was really happy to get a iDubs TV video through with the is on it and i'm happy to do a little look at it great game this too um it's got drama whoa ho, ho, ho. frank leopard says thanks for the ammo rack haven't had one of those for a while right to the face uh and we get a little bit of a, a comment on life at large by the i dubs good on you mate now we're gonna have a look at this one then we're gonna have a look at owen wilson longtime friend of the channel and possible golden globe nominee now, here we go. We're pushing towards the middle in the IS. Lots of action on the left here. The KV-2, menacing. Uh, not very menacing there. Once you've fired, mate, we've got about three weeks to get the reload done. And you can see, in typical Blitz fashion, the rest of the team is coming apart at the seams. They are struggling. It's gone for the HE. Now, you can do that with the IS. It's got a big booty and a big bloody gun for a tier 7 heavy. Uh, 400 alpha there, no problems whatsoever. And he's running the big 120, which is great. And on the pump now, five minutes to go and he's found a very likely customer. Unfortunately, not quite the return on the HE investment he was looking for. Uh, might have to go back to a diversification into shares in the portfolio. But he's got three in front of him, which is good. That means he's only missing two. Uh, can he sneak a HE shot in there? Come on, just go to AP. Does, goes to AP, rolls 380 and is happy about it. Doesn't want to help the ARL V39 there too much. Those are damages that someone else can deal with. And the Bulldog is very interested in clearing that ARL. Should be more worried about the IS that's coming towards him. And voila. The 2801 is calling people imbeciles. You know you're in blitz when people are being called imbeciles. That's that's where the love is. And I know, look at that buttocks, American buttocks. Come on. Yes, not quite the return on the investment again. Still and all, not a bad opportunity. Loves shooting a bit of HE. He scoped out the HE. Can't get anything HE-wise into the side of the Panther. And he's going to have to settle for an AP. You were using HE, idiot. Oh, the VK is on an exciting roll. I was talking to you, question mark. Oh, Blitz. This is where we come to form personal, loving, and caring relationships and learn how to deal with the trials and tribulations of life. Down to a two on three. Things are looking okay. The damage is absolute to say you rot in hell. There you go. The uh, VK is firm in his stance. Run right in hell to you. Uh, okay. Anyway, we're going to stop commentating on that because that is not a great conversation. And oh, but he's just starting to learn spelling. I'm riveted. Ah, here we go. Two on one. Need a good shot here. Big HE roll. 247. Not, not the, uh, not the droids you were looking for. And here's the problem. This ARL is pretty bloody good. Uh, it's a great tank. Oh, nice spot on the Hellcat. Well done. Not taking that shot there. That was a shot that was desperately needed. And he's held on. And he's got it. Jojo Pedro Andrade Hero. Ow. Not ideal. Now, he's got 4,000 damage. Oh, the VK2801 is telling him to push. Because that's not what he's been doing. He's just been waiting. Um, the ARL, such a good tank. 411. He needs to get some clutch bounces and pen everything. Um, can he do it? Clutch bounce. Bounce one off your buttocks. I dare you. He gets a buttock bounce. Oh, but that one hits the side of the panther. That, boys and girls, could well be the game. That is tough, tough, tough gig. Oh, come on, come on. Get around. Nice driving. Very svelte use of the panther. And another buttock bounce. Surely we're going to get one in here. And not much to do now. This is... He basically needs to pray for rain. Come on! Oh, and the ARL says negative. Not happening today. Not on my watch. And that is a lovely tank too, the ARL, mind you. 
4,889 damage. Have a look at them apples. That is a great gig in the IS. Well played there, iDubs TV. Well done, well done. Now here comes Owen Wilson in this mishmash of Russian Chinese design. The Glacial IS3 WZ11 Extra IS5 looks a little bit like that, but isn't one of them. No gun depression. Uh, take. And he is on the wonderful Normandy map, looking for a little bit of action at the top of the hill, where two tanks who don't have any gun depression are trying to peek each other and do bad things. Now, the interesting thing about this one from Owen Wilson is that this is really not where you would expect this tank to be. It doesn't bode particularly well as a gun depression tank, and both the IS-5 and Owen, however, have decided that this is the best place. Unfortunately, the only people they're able to damage are other tanks because their gun depression just doesn't quite let them get down. Now, Owen's on a reload. This IS-3 on the right is going to have to be careful he doesn't cop one on the side, and he does, in fact, get poached by the IS-5 over there. The... I don't know what that FCM-50 is thinking. Um, coming up sideways... Whoa, back it up, back it up, back it up one time. Oh, he was on there. Just, look, you've got to get up. Goes to the heat. Well done. No shame at all. And the heat is fired in return. And no, says R and Jesus. So, Owen Wilson off to the races. 1,192 damage. We might see that IS featuring again later. Let's see the Lerva. Mr. Lerva, Lerva. He's looking hot and heavy at the top of the map as he comes in and starts searching for all the answers that a flank can provide. Now, that IS-3 got pegged and poached before by the IS-5, but didn't actually take any damage and has a really actually done a very, very good job at the base of the hill here, holding the push from the red team. He's done a lot of work there, uh, commendable effort, and he and Owen Wilson have done their best, contrived to hold back the forces of inequity and evil, and they are doing very, very well. Owen Wilson doing a good job with a tank that is sometimes difficult to get the most out of. Looking for a tracking shot. Great shot. Not giving up anything in terms of tactical advantage there. Still with a really easy side scrape back to the left or right. Or he can poke or he can just go under the gun. Just uses the lack of gun depression on the 111-1 GFT and gets a nice lower plate shot. And suddenly it's three on two. But at the back of the map there is a big dog. A very big dog. And Owen Wilson is worried about that big dog. Falcon X-25 Sparrow IS-3 has done a nice job. He's going to go sideways. That is not a good idea, Falcon. That is poking out next to the ISU-152. And I love how Owen Wilson says, Hey, buddy, over there. Taps it out. Over there. Bad tank. Doing good things. Owen Wilson is on the pump. Oh, they meet in the middle. 148 damage though from that ram. The IS-5 only took 112. And then a bounce. Things look grim. Things are not as dim as they seem, though. He's got the adrenaline, and he has popped the adrenaline off. There's two on one. Surely Owen can suck it up and bring home the bacon here, looking for the weak spot on the base. And he's, again, failing on the IS-5. Now, this is the IS-5's Ressender. It is not uh, a long-range sniper. It is not a gun depression tank. It is a face-hugging grub. Uh, and he's... Oh, hang on, though. The lower plate is available 4,000 damage for Owen Wilson. Great effort here so far. And the IS-5 taps out the KV-3. This is a must hit. Got to watch out. That could be a high roll. Oh, what's going on now? Interesting. And now we're going to have a lot of touchy-touchy feely-feely because they are both, in fact, one-shots. Uh, Owen Wilson in the WZ is one-shot. And that young amigo down there in the IS-5 has done pretty well, has run the front line the entire time and face-hugged his way to a chance at glory is also a one-shot. And they're both heading down to the beach to settle this in the sand, mano a mano, like you do when you're at the beach and someone takes your spot and their towel is too close to yours and you're like, buddy, back off! Your towel's too close to... Oh, Owen, it's there, it's there! He goes to the heat. Oh, he's desperate. He knows, though. He's an experienced campaigner. That shot's foolish. That shot's not. 4,175 damages. Maximum Owen Wilson. Possible Golden Globe winner and hell of a tanker. 4,400 damage, basically. Uh, and a solid effort. 3,200 from the IS-5 there. So, nice finish there. Both tanks deserving of a podium place. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Hope you guys are having a good time. As always, over the hol holiday season, take care of yourselves. Be nice to your family. Say good day to everyone and uh, stay safe on the battlefield. Bye for now.